Yeah, it's great to see you. You had a couple of knocks in pre-season. How much was it a relief and, and enjoyment to play on the day one of the season? Oh, definitely. Um, I was obviously quite disappointed um, to miss out on the Carlisle game. Obviously, it was a club that done really well for me as well, so I was disappointed with that. But obviously, it wasn't anything serious. So at the end of the day, I was quite happy to to be back out there with the lads. Yeah, you've commented on how hard you worked in pre-season. So I mentioned a couple of uh, a few days. It wasn't the end of the world, and you obviously you were fully fit to go on day one. No, definitely. It's obviously what you work for in pre-season and get your fitness up so when I did uh, jar my knee in training I was a bit worried to start off with but obviously got scanned and came back all clear just a bit of bit of sprain on the back of the knee so now I was really happy and I could get back out there ready for the first game yeah. mm. We were worried about you at Ipswich because very early in, in the piece you went down and, and hurt your shoulder we were concerned about you what, what, what were your thoughts at that moment? Yeah obviously I just feel like the referees didn't give the decision in the first five ten minutes of them games when we told the ref that um, they were all over us in the box and obviously I felt like I got dragged down and I feel like it should have been a penalty but obviously we move on and obviously the shoulder's fine now so I'll be ready for Saturday. Yeah good man you, you got through the 19 it was a really impressive defensive performance from the side wasn't it? I had to dig deep in that second half it shows some good qualities. Yeah definitely it was a really tough second half especially um, I felt like we stuck together as a team really well and obviously Traff's made some unbelievable saves and we've all made some good blocks in the towards the end of the game so now we were really happy with the way we finished defensively obviously we feel like we could have done more on the ball um, but to go away there first game of the season to come away with something we were uh, we were pleased with yeah and in terms of a benchmark for determination if you like and, and design not to lose was that a good marker to put down on day one yeah 100% um, I feel like in the previous two seasons that I've been here um, we, we might have gone under um, and I think the, the determination of the squad now is, is really good and we all really work hard for each other um, as we do every day in training so uh, I think it was a really good benchmark for us um, for on Saturday. And the manager said how tough it was to pick a team and, and be almost a squad last Saturday. It, it looks a good squad on paper doesn't it? 100% I mean the, the intensity in training every single day is really high. We've got a really strong squad. Um, Gaffer's obviously really struggling to pick an 18-man squad, never mind uh, the starting 11, so we're all working really hard in training every day to, to make sure that we're in that team. Yeah, good solid base, then point on day one, at home for the first day on Saturday, it's always a special occasion, first time game, supporters will be here full of hope and expectation, it's a good one to look forward to. Yeah, we're all we're all buzzing for it, to be honest, um, obviously we've all seen how many season tickets that we've sold, and obviously it'll be a very tough game against Wickham as well, so now we're really excited for the day. Yeah, as you say, it'll be a tough game, a bit like Ipswich, they're probably a little bit of a marker for how the division may be and an awful long way to go and a lot of sides will, uh, will be backing themselves but uh, indication. 100% yeah Wickham are obviously up there towards the end of last season so it'll be another platform to see where we're at um, we've obviously worked really hard this week on how we want to take our game, game to them so obviously it all pays off on Saturday for us. But equally we're hoping that the boot's on the other foot and, and uh, they'll be looking at you and thinking well these are a side that are going to be there and head about. No definitely um, I feel like I've spoke to one or two lads um, from Ipswich after the game and um, they said that they really concentrated on the way we played mm -hmm. um, during the week and they feel that we're going to be strong and up there towards the end of the season so as long as we work hard every day in training um, hopefully we will be. Yeah, the home form was terrific in the second half of last season and I suppose the plan is just to try and continue that and build on that? Yeah 100% obviously um, playing in front of your own fans always helps um, sometimes get on you for not doing so well but obviously cheer you on when you are so now we're really looking forward to this season playing in front of our home fans. Uh, going back briefly to Wickham last season, was that the, if I remember, serves? You played in the reserves in the afternoon, then came off the bench in the evening. Have yeah. I got the right game? Yeah, that was it, yeah. Obviously, I was out for, I can't remember, what was it 12 weeks I yes, was out for yes, with a stress fracture, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, obviously, I remember playing in the afternoon. I can't remember. Was it Accrington? Uh, Fleetwood, 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 Fleetwood yeah, yeah. I played against Fleetwood in the afternoon, in the afternoon, and then the gaffer told me at half time, um, do you fancy coming off and maybe being on the bench for us tonight? So, obviously, yeah, I was I was keen to, to be back out there with the lads, and obviously did come on um, in that game against Wickham. So, now nah, I remember that night very well. Yeah. yeah, you've never looked back since, and the team hasn't either because we lost that uh, that evening. But since then, you've only lost once at home. That was a catalyst, wasn't it? With a really good run, the squad came together. Yeah. You got back in the side, and uh, I think. 
think we might see a different team this this weekend? No, definitely. Obviously, um, back then, um, before that little run, we we changed. We did, had a different formation. Sorry, um, and we've all took grips on how the way we want to play now. And um, like you said, we've got a really strong squad. January helped us uh, like a lot, and obviously we've got a few more players in this summer. So now nah, I think we're all really buzzing for Saturday. Yeah, just lastly then, and uh, hope same for the season. I know it's a bit of an unfair one. We, we all hope the same, but everybody's at this stage of the season, you know, really optimistic and looking around the place. Why wouldn't we be? No, definitely. Obviously, the way we want to go about it, we we want to feel that pressure. We 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 want to because we want we won't be at this club if we if we didn't get want didn't want to get promoted. Sorry. So now we're all we're all buzzing um, for the season, and obviously the first six games going to be a good platform mm -hmm. for us. So now nah, we're really looking forward to playing in front of our fans. I think.